All right, well, waiting on my wife right now. She takes way too long just to put some clothes on. We're gonna go pick up the boat. The power pole should be on by the time I get there. I'm super excited. Uh, you guys are about to see this thing. Here we go. Okay, so you know what? I don't even care if I look like an idiot holding the camera. I'm gonna finish this video because I wanna go eat. Here's the boat. There it is, ZX200 2011. Really clean, the guy that had it before me was, I mean, it's immaculate. <clears throat> um, I just had the poles put on. That's like the coolest feature I've ever had for a boat. I just, just picked it up today. I also had, uh, I also just had these installed. These uh, power pole buttons, I'm not gonna, I'm not good with having stuff around my neck. That, I would lose it in a heartbeat. Um, here's the other side of the boat. I mean, I got two hummingbirds that I don't have on right now because I'm cruising around and I don't trust people. So uh, I got the powerful blades. That's the ones I went with. Uh, matches the boat, of course. Um, it's a great boat. It's got tons of storage. Let's go up here and uh, get into the storage boxes real quick for y'all. It's got uh, two live wells in the back, just like any other standard boat would have. Uh, two 20 gallon tanks storage boxes back here just like any other boat would have I, I emptied them out of course when I, before I took the boat in uh, left side of this boat has uh, the rod boxes or, excuse me the rod box Oops. oh it's tight it's, it's a tight one right. so that's empty right now it's got pretty good you could stick an 8.5 foot rod in there uh, if I ever need an 8.5 foot rod on my boat I'm probably doing something wrong but anyway I got two of those one here one there and then another box um, I mean of course then it's got a uh, ice chest right there but look how cool look how cool these blades are I've been messing with them a little bit so all I do is push on the button once I think maybe I don't maybe I gotta yeah there you go Look at that, look how awesome that is. Come down, push the button up. Oh yeah. Way better than having the thing dangling around your neck and having to go and push it, just go down and step on it. Those only, that, that, those pedals only cost me 70 bucks. Well worth the 70 bucks, so. All right guys, this quick video, of course what my boat looks like. Nothing crazy, uh, got tournament this weekend. Uh, two days worth of tournaments. Actually fishing a squall. So I'm sure you guys, if you're fishing it, you'll see me out there. I'm not a talkative person, so I probably will just kind of keep to myself. Um, which is kind of weird because I make videos. But anyway, uh, do me a favor, guys. Hit that subscribe button, and uh, hopefully we'll catch some big ones this weekend. Until then, see y'all. All right, guys. Today, I'm going to go over. I have the entire suit, the entire Sims uh, Gore-Tex Pro suit. Uh, I have the bibs over there in the top here. I'm just going to go real quick. It's that time of season that you're going to want a good rain suit here in Texas. This last weekend, it was just pouring rain all weekend, and I wore this. I went and bought it the week before because I didn't feel like standing, standing around on my boat in the rain during these tournaments just struggling. 